Hello Collective, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for all of your likes, your comments, your shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate them all, you guys. You guys are so amazing. Let's tap in to get a message for you guys. Let's see what the messages are for you guys. Let's see. Uh -oh. Let's see what the messages are. Ooh, the lovers. I like to see that card. Okay, something changing here. <sighs> Expect the change, okay, to come from someone. Somebody wants you to know something about to be different. It's going to be different this time. Yeah, something about to, I don't know what that means. Cupid did a little Taurus here. I um, don't have to be, okay, or Gemini. But somebody wants you to know something about to be different this time. It's about to be different this time. Like, I don't know what happened last time. The fuck? But whatever. Um, so I'm about to be different this time. Or something is changing in your life. And it's going to bring about a lot of different, you know, situations. All right. So let's see. Okay. Yeah. Like, <laughs> it's about to be different this time. Somebody is on this path to marriage. Somebody want to marry your ass. Okay, they want to, this, whatever you are about to get into here is going to lead to marriage, all right? It's going to be different this time. March 10th could be significant, all right? Yeah, somebody in their thoughts, they think about you. Okay, who is? Ooh. All right, uh, well, so we got expectations in the distant horizon. There's going to be some sort of ending. Somebody's in despair that they under adjudication for being a false person, all right? Trying to get some extras out of you or something like that. But like, something about to be different. Something about to be different with a situation. Somebody want to come towards you. They want a partnership with you or something like that. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, what is this? Look how this just flipped out, y'all. So this journey here, somebody could be experienced, lost everything here to balance something out, okay, for a situation. Like, what? So somebody gave up a lot to balance something out with you. So, was it an ultimatum? Like, well, if you want, yeah, if you want such and such to be balanced out, you gotta give up this, this, that, and a third. That could have happened for somebody, y'all. Like, what? All right, what is this? What's the overall energy here? What is this? Journey and marriage, okay? Yeah, okay, so your intuition, intuition. <laughs> Your intuition is saying that there's good changes, rebirth, something's about to be different this time. Okay, because maybe somebody had to start from rock bottom. Oh, I'm seeing that card in my mind's eye. So somebody had to start from the scratch, okay, to uh, get a new beginning here. So they had to forfeit whatever they had going on. Could have been a family situation, could have been a job, could have been something. But somebody was like, fuck it for this. All right, fuck it, because I'm ready to... Had this long-term success with somebody. Um, yeah. So, love conquers all, of course. So, somebody was so hell-bent on material possession, okay? They're like, fuck that shit. I want love now. So, I don't know, okay? It's funny because uh, um, it was a... Uh, one of those reels on Instagram came across my uh, feed and it was an older lady and she says um, she was talking about sex and loves how sometimes people confuse sex with love and that's not the case. She says sex is good. You should have sex, you know, as much as possible, of course, but in moderation, right? Not with just any old body, of course, right? But she was like, um, sex is fun, you know, um, exciting. Love is like a bench. And, why, and I'm like, so as she goes on to speak about what love was like, she's like, love is uh, always going to have your back, not sex, right? Um, love is uh, when you're tired of all of the running around and then you finally get a chance to sit down and sit back on that bench and it's nice and sturdy because love has to be sturdy has to be on a firm foundation you don't think of a bench right and like and I'm like wow so I totally got that whole metaphor right and it's true though because love always got your back 
okay? So this is like, whatever this is, is like, you're the love, okay? Um, Somebody was out there swinging it, okay? And they know that you got their back, whoever you are, okay? <laughs> Take it as it resonates, y'all. But yeah, look at you. You are like the ideal person, of course. Why wouldn't they want to marry you? Like if they was going to fall in love or settle down with anybody, it would be you kind of energy. Aw. That's so cute. That's so cute. That's so cute. <laughs> That's so cute. I love it. All right. So, yeah. So, somebody saying goodbye to somebody or something from their past or whatever. It's to get in full alignment here with whoever you are. All right. Yeah, because they don't want to be in the prison no more. That past was their prison or something like that. So that's you. This even could be you guys releasing some sort of baggage that you have from your past so that you can move forward and actually obtain a marriage or a relationship, something long term and successful. All right. But I just heard here I come. Uh, like somebody coming. They're like, here I come. Like, don't wait. Don't, don't get on the bus yet. Something significant about uh, trains could be significant. CM could be significant. All right. Spirit, what's that message? All right. Oh, my gosh. So, <laughs> this one day, uh, I went to the movies with my daughter. And um, I was waiting for her uh, to go get the car. You know, shit like that. And this guy stopped to ask me, uh, do you know where Jefferson Station is? And I'm like, I never even heard of that, right? So in my travels one day, I was out and about. And don't you know, I looked to my left and there was Jefferson Station. I was like, wait, I found Jefferson Station. So somebody, somebody was looking for somebody like you. I know this is like all these men are like, first of all, what the fuck? Listen, it's, it's going to tie into the reading. I just feel like it is. Whatever this is, it's like somebody could have, could travel for a living for some of you guys. Or this is somebody that... It's like they've been looking for somebody like you. Or they've been waiting till they got their shit together to actually approach you. For some of you guys. You might even know this person. And some of y'all, this is a brand new person. All right? But they intuitively know that you, yeah, you the one they gonna marry, okay? Yeah, you got authentic energy, natural, okay? Yeah, this somebody that been watching your ass, okay? They see you as like 100% you. You're real, you're authentic, original, okay? Somebody could be from the islands, I don't know what the fuck that was. All right, but somebody be like your original, honey. Yeah, and they want your forgiveness. They like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Can we, can we, can I come back now? Like, damn, I fucked up. Like, um, yeah. So somebody want to come back because they feel like they fucked up. They sorry and shit. Damn, not like that. They not saying it like that. No, they not. Mm -mm. They're actually having some sort of empathy for real, y'all. Mm -hmm. What else, Spirit? Why they want redemption? They praying for you or they prayed for redemption. They prayed that God would give them this chance. So God said, well, you won't have to be your authentic self. Yeah, you won't have to take the mask off to all of this and then the third if you want one, my baby. Okay. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> You gonna have to heal all this, baby. Mm-mm. Cause you got these monsters within, bruh, and or sis. You gonna have to fix that. Okay, if you wanna come back to my baby. Yeah. I feel like somebody definitely was going through something, y'all. Somebody definitely uh is changing a course here about what they was wishing here. Yeah, cause God, like I wish you the fuck would. I why well, I swear to God, kind of energy here. I don't know. Um, because you got this vitality here and this anti-hero is like so in love with you like this is so crazy y'all but somebody definitely is changing their stripes okay like they're being their original self so before this person was who they were they could have been like very nice at one point i don't know what happened so somebody gonna have to heal this 
monster within energy here. But they're repairing. God is definitely repairing this here, recovering some sort of energy here because they pray for redemption. All right. Yeah. This that Beyonce energy. Like, what's that song? Don't she have a song named Redemption? Okay. Listen. I think. Oh, that's not right. But, yeah. Look at that. Woo. So somebody had big ego issue. Like, what? I am that man. Okay. Explain to my ankles, bruh. Like, I am him. What you mean? Like, bow down, bitches. Like, kind of energy. Maybe this, that per person was could have been extremely cocky. Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, until they, they rose above this. So, they're getting growing above this energy. Their ego is... Psh, okay. Wow. It's going away. No more ego. Okay. Yeah. The right use of power. Okay. 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 I ain't down listen. Like, I did this shit the right way. Or I'm not going to have no chance or shot. But somebody really won't be with y'all. Or something like that. Or this is a friend, family, whatever. This is, honey. They praying to God. Because you was always real. You was always authentic with this person. And they want redemption. Because they was on some bullshit. They know that. <laughs> it's like, I know I was on some bullshit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just wanted you to worship me. I like what I like on some fucking future shit. Like, uh-uh, future. Okay. What's this? Look at that. I, what did I say? Oh, look at Oh, look at him. Oh, look at him. <laughs> so, this was a faded event here. Okay. Wow. Adaptability. Okay. Forgiveness and the fates, y'all. So, wow. Yeah, so this person here, we got a uh, right timing for this fallen angel energy. Like I said, they was maybe have been an anti-hero for a long fucking time, y'all. But they needed the courage to step into life. This was the perfect storm for whomever this is. Like, this is a crow with peacock feathers. Like, y'all see them feathers? Yeah. Mm. Wow. So it's divine timing. Was that work for this person here? Or this situation? Because I'm going to just take this. Okay. Okay. There you go, divine feminine. So we got gestational period. What's happening? All right. Intentional forgiveness. Wow. Beloved radical acceptance. The talent says hidden in the shadows here. This was the faded event here. Wow. Yeah, because your person, whoever this is, been straddled in between worlds here. And it was like an obstacle to get to you. All right, because God was not about to let this person ego. Like, no, the fuck you think this was? So we had to, you know, let that go. Okay. Hmm. So something is actually in the making right now. Okay. Okay. Let me find out. Let me find out, collective. Let me see. Where's that girl say this going on? New phone, who this? So somebody might need your number. Okay, new phone, who this? Kind of Hold up. I'm trying to find the right chords here. I'm not finding them, y'all, but let me get my other deck. Oh, okay. Well, then. <sighs> okay. Let's see here. Just to go in. Oh, yeah. Yes, you can't stop. Yeah. Okay. Can't stop my flow. You ain't give no damn who this person was flirting with. Flirting with your ops and shit. You was like, oh, all right. Say less. Have a good day. All right. You might not have to know these people they was flirting with, but just still. Yeah. Can't stop my flow with meeting another person. Ooh, somebody that met somebody. What's going on? 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 Yeah. Okay. You could have been spending time alone here. Why this person could have been meeting other people, doing all types of shit, thinking it was going to affect you. Like, gosh, all these songs I'm hearing. Okay. So, what's that song? Um, Scorpio by, uh, 
money bag, yo, when he be like, uh, going from one, uh, nigga to the next, moving around fast, don't let her, I just let her do it. She do that shit to think it make me, it make me mad. Stubborn and aggressive, possessive. So somebody stubborn, aggressive, and possessive, that's how this person was flowing with their life here. He was like, all right. <laughs> Alright, I'm I'ma just I'ma rock this out by myself on this side over here. I don't got time for this shit. You go ahead on with that energy. Alright. Um, this is not your world or energy like shit like that. And this person was like, oh man, what the fuck I did? I gotta figure this shit out. Okay. Cause you was already out the duck. Okay. From this person that is set some serious intentions here to be with you. Yeah, look. That's because somebody was at a Zork and you was at a light. That's why. Okay. Crazy ass. Yeah. And this person could have been spending time with their family or something. They might got kids with somebody else here. But think about your ass kind of energy. Mm, well, they make, what is this? I don't know what's going on. This just kind of fell out here. Spending time alone. Wait. Okay. We're going to just take it though. Because it came out. We're going to take it. But spending time alone here, dark magic here, dark magic spell work here. Somebody may have thoughts. What? We're going to keep going. Somebody could have did some sort of spell work on somebody or told somebody that you did dark magic to seduce them. Or did somebody do that to them? What is happening? Tied to obligations. Sleep talking. Is this the eternal struggle this person was having? What is this shit? I don't know. Fighting the connection here. Popularity is in the way. I don't know who the fuck this is. This don't sound, this don't feel like the person that I'm talking about. This could be somebody that was your op. That could have been doing spell work here. Making you think this person was gay for pay. Thank you, Father. I'm like, what? That don't make sense. It did not. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this person definitely, you got fighting the connection. This is them. Fighting the connection here. So, okay. They could have been, okay. Let's rewind. They could have been tied to somebody here. Okay. Prior obligations, hands tied. Whoever this person is that was gay for pay, this could have been somebody they was with. And this could have been a female, okay? I don't feel like this is the person you were talking to or the person I'm talking about. But that was the culture difference. That was the difference. Maybe this person allowed like third parties in their connection. This is somebody they had kids with or something like that. All right. Hmm. But we got fighting the connection. So this person was fighting the connection here. Popularity got in the way here. Holding back their feelings. Alright, you hearing all the tea here. Okay. Wow. Secret rendezvous. I love it when you text me or call me. Yeah, okay. So whoever this is, they left this person. This is some weird shit, okay? Yeah, will you... Look, this person gonna plan on in this together. They, yeah, and whoever this sexual interest checking their phone here because they know they missing you. Papa was a rolling stone here. Social media drama. So, yeah. All right, all right. Because I'm like, who the fuck? Mm-mm, mm-mm. Somebody was doing black magic to make you think this person was gay for pay or something like that for some of y'all. Okay, take it as it resonates. Some of y'all, it could have been like that. I don't know. But uh, this is somebody they was tied to. All right, this person was doing black magic over them. Okay. I heard Clarissa. Okay, could be her name they tied to. I don't know. But um, yeah, so I feel like Right in this connection, somebody you hearing all the tea here because somebody want to have a secret rendezvous with you. All right, I feel like 
popularity was getting in the way here of this connection here on who, how many people want you. So that's another thing. So whoever she is, a lot of people may not like desire them as much people desire you or something like that. Um, they saying goodbye to somebody here. All right. Like I said, they could have said goodbye to somebody here. This person is less than over you, looking good for you. And this is somebody you got uh, feelings for too. Will you marry me in this together? Hmm. Yeah, will you marry me in this together here? Okay. So whoever she is, this temptress, this Jeze Jezebel, Jezebel energy, uh, was checking this person's phone and seeing that they was missing you. This is somebody that can be on and off with here. She always causes social media drama here. So she could have been stalking y'all page or seeing that this person messaged you, called you, liked you or whatever the fuck. Right? Um, Because they knew that she knew that his mind was, no matter how many threesomes she tried to throw at this person. Um, Yeah. <laughs> That's the falling for, for you gullible energy. But your mind focused over there. Somebody was being very aggressive here because they had options here. But yeah, like this is somebody that thought they was like God's gift here. You seen right through them or something like that? Child, what the fuck is this? Or that's how she's seeing them. So whoever she is, is trying, you know, and maybe this is the reason why y'all not dealing with this person. All right. Because of this temptress energy or something like that. But somebody want to have a secret rendezvous with you? Or y'all were having secret rendezvous? Alright. Maybe it was a sexual connection. Maybe going to the coffee shop or whatever this is. She got coffee and biscuits at on the table. You know. Having relations and going getting coffee. <laughs> that could be a thing for somebody. I don't know. Alright. Alright, y'all. What is this? Alright, that's too many cards, sweetheart. Mm -mm. Maybe you knew this was a third part. Okay, see. Alright, yeah. Somebody nervous, y'all. Whoever this person is, he don't know. Or she don't know how you gonna take this. Or how you gonna reciprocate this connection. How they wanna be with you. And all this cool stuff. So, that's, that's just... I'm in the sweet guy, this. Damn, Queen of Swords, okay? Damn! Okay, because y'all both tried to come out in the reverse here. Whoever this is, all right, Queen of Swords tried to come out in the reverse. King of Swords in the reverse, what the fuck? There was some sort of illusion here, all right? That somebody was an addict or addicted to some being immature here in this connection. Yes, this twin flame in the past maybe knew you was going to be successful here. In your life and they was just being an asshole but we're not gonna take no reversals like come on all right so somebody definitely um is not like already from the the gun bus like shit somebody is not liking that whatever's literally back to happen here okay we got the higher thing here all right so in the future there's gonna be a wedding or a marriage Somebody might propose to you. Will you marry me, ass energy? Okay. How do you come in here now, though? Maybe two of pentacles. They trying to figure some things out. Bringing balance to this. All right. See. <laughs> yeah, because then maybe you consciously aware here that uh, something going to have to change in this two of cups situation. All right. Because this king of pentacles. This king of, I say king of pentacles could be a Taurus or a Leo Aries. What the fuck? I ain't, that ain't even the damn King of Cups. Like, I'm trying to, so Leo, Aries, Sag, or a King of Cups, or a King of Taurus, god damn it. Could be significant here. All right, um, Four of Pentacles here is they, they was trying to control something. That shit backfire here because you still got victory and success by walking the fuck away, or they still see you leaving. I'm like, god damn, like, let me get the fuck up and get over there and off because she's not even going to wait, like, 
Whatever this magic they was doing blew up in their damn face. You still moving forward. They like, oh my God. This person had the nerve to try to fight the connection because this somebody was popular or some bullshit ass energy. I don't know. Could be a Taurus or a Capricorn here. But somebody definitely feel like they, they juggled this here. All right. They trying to bring balance here. The obstacle though. Yeah, judgment. It's up to you. Yeah, because they got to be trustworthy. So God said, if you want this, you're going to have to be trustworthy. Ain't no juggling, no back and forth, no in and out. You're going to have to be solid, okay, in this situation. What is the um, outcome? Come on. See, we're not about to do this. The outcome looks like somebody's about to end the cycle of being single or shit, having a new beginning now that they single. Somebody stressed the fuck out because you the empress. And they like, oh my God, like somebody really is stressed the fuck out because somebody want to be with you. Strong Taurus or Capricorn, Stance sitting right here, okay? What is this higher thing? Yeah, so whoever this person is lied about being single at one point. What's the Seven of Swords? Yeah, Nine of Cups here being self. Now they wish they can apologize and offer you something more solid. What's the Nine of Cups? Hermit energy. I feel like they wishing that you would go with then soul search here or you was wishing that for them or maybe somebody was feeling smug and tell you ghost ass he was like all right because so that can be you so you they could have feeling stay yeah somebody lied about being in a relationship or married you found out they was feeling smug or feeling some type of way here until you ghosted them and now they scared that they little illusion and for you to be tempted over there ain't gonna work yeah this person know they gonna have to put the work in to be with you it's like we not about to we not doing none of that all right so yeah what's this two of pentacles here yeah so we got the king of wands here yeah like all right let me get my ass up you know become this leader here because this person is imbalanced or caused some sort of imbalance when it came to taking ancient towards you. All right. On this path here, I feel like um, you could be at a crossroads here when it comes to this person having the actual discipline to do the work to, so that you can take the damn leap of faith because they're afraid you're going to let their ass go for real, for real. And they're going to miss this opportunity to be with your ass because they may have walked away from you at one point here. All right. What's the King of Wands doing here? King of Wands, wait, what you want? Yeah, they don't want to let you go. That was hidden. That was that was the hidden truth is that they was trying to control the situation or hold on to you. Eh, eh. But you was like, damn. You like, oh my God. So you walked away from this person. And they like, oh my God. Okay, strong Capricorn, Pisces, Leo. Virgo, Aquarius, Cancer, Taurus, so far. Okay, y'all. You be dealing with any of them signs or this day signs in a chart. Their obstacle here is this awakening here or to realize what the fuck is the going on here? What's the judgment here? Or the universe calling judgment on this? What's the judgment here? Yeah, for them to, okay, overcome their pride here, Leo energy, so that they can, you can trust them again. So, yeah, that's that uh redemption energy okay because you're looking at this motherfucker side eye now at this point like what you want like okay what's this six of wands here yeah because this person was a player and shit or now they want to come rushing in with some communication i feel like um they feel defeated because you're very successful and wealthy right now and they feel like it's going to be too challenging here Okay, now that you got all this power, so that could be you here. Popular, popularity is in the way who you are. Like they wanna, they are they intimidated by that or something like that. What's this um Knight of Wands here? Because they wanna come rushing in, and be it impulsive. Like yeah, let's get this shit popping. If this energy, Knight of Wands, and you like, I wish a bitch would. No, they scared now. Intuitively. They a little nervous of you now, looking like you look like you're looking like you're looking. Okay, this is you, Empress. This King of Pentacles energy now. Eight of Pentacles. You don't worked hard as fuck, or they know they gonna have to actually do some work to, for you to get this damn. They like shit. All right, let me let me get my ass up. I keep hearing it. Okay, like let me get my shit together because this is it. This is the person I'm gonna wind up marrying. Kind of energy. 
Um, and they know that you're not about to take no losses. <laughs> if they want you, they're going to have to actually do some. Yeah. Whew. Man. But we got the world card. So we got a whole brand new cycle. Archangel Michael right here with you. Okay. Archangel Haniel to for you to forgive this person and of their lustful ways and being a whore and stuff. Uh, whatever they was into or putting you on the back burner like you wasn't it. Like, wait. Okay. What's this for uh, world card? Somebody feel like they're not going to be able to heal this with you because all this conflict or all these people that want you. I worry about the wrong shit. What's the world card? The moon. Yeah, they're going to have to close out them fears here. Okay, or some sort of illusions. That this king and queen of... Pen oh, is that it? This queen of pentacles here. They could be in fear. That you knew something here. That they gotta get realistic here. This emperor is heartbroken because they know they're gonna have to be the king of pentacles and do the work. They're gonna have to be responsible to be with you. What is this? Or it's the queen of pentacles secretly working with a king of cups to get you to in yeah. What? What's the moon? Yeah, no. Nah. They would have to close out something here in secret or some sort of illusion. All right, in whatever way this is, and actually, because something will be challenging if they don't have the courage here to make a decision. All right, to tell you how they feel, Queen of Swords, because you're gonna leave, and then everything is just gonna be a tower moment. Maybe a, it was a tower because. In the past, they could have had you in a third party and you found out they really was in a relationship and you was like, oh no, like the fuck is this? All right. They also could be afraid about your success here, okay? This is a lot. This brand new cycle or this person is closing out fear of your success or of a family dynamic. Somebody family could be involved like extra. What's the Ten of Pentacles here? Or they closing out some sort of family dynamic. What's the Ten of Pentacles here? The four, yeah, damn. Look, damn, okay. So, um, yeah. They could be afraid that you're not going to want to be with them like that. Yeah, look at that. Nine of Swords right there. King of Pentacles. This person wants to have a relationship with you and long-term success, but they're afraid that you're not going to want to be with them. Okay? Whoever this Leo, this Taurus, this Aries, this Aquarius, this Virgo, whoever this is, they, they you got them shook a little bit, sweetheart. Like, damn, they scared of you. Okay? Because you your willpower, all right, they can't stop you. Yeah, you know how to manifest shit, okay? So they know they got to change for this reconciliation or they're going to be left out in the cold and you're going to be single and partner up with somebody the fuck else and they're going to miss this opportunity. And if you take that type of action, they're going to be all in their head and want to fuck up. So I'm not fuck somebody up here because this is the twin flame connection. They want to be with you. So this person has really got to put their uh, big boy pants on at this time. Because this is crucial. Y'all are really at that 333 energy. Crucial point of your journey where y'all about to move beyond all previous setbacks. But this person is nervous. You make them nervous. Okay? You make somebody real nervous. Like, for real. Yeah. Maybe because of how they feel about you. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. Okay? It could be a new love. All right. A new person that stirs romantic feelings. You make this person nervous. This could be somebody you gonna marry and shit. Like, I don't know why. Okay, like, what the fuck is this? Or you gonna meet a new person and they gonna marry your ass? Child, listen. Take the message as it resonates. Yeah, forgiving and learning, cause somebody feel like you're not gonna forgive them or 
as you heal and release the past, you experience more love in your present moment. Or there is somebody that you got to forgive from your past. Collective, take care of it. It resonates. Wow. Yeah, this is, this, is, this is a deep soul connection. You've known each other before. Whoever this person is, whether new or somebody existing coming back in your life, you know this person. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gestures here. Stay optimistic. They trying to... They a little nervous. I'm telling you. Look how he looking like. I don't want to tell her how I really feel. Because, you know, I ain't trying to have her run away, you know. But this person... Wow. Yeah, somebody is scared. I, it's just... I don't know what this is about, y'all. Somebody's scared of you. And they just feel like you're not going to forgive them if this is somebody that's coming back around. Because that was in the reverse. All right. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Maybe this is what you are needing to release if this is a new love. Okay. That you got a strong magnetic attraction to. Okay. They want you to release that shit so y'all can be together. Okay. For some of y'all. Let's see. What is this? Yeah. Can we just talk? So whoever this is, just want to talk a little bit. Water sign is in love with you here. All right. They're trying to find a way to run into you. Okay. Why can't I find somebody like you? Karma, shortcut with the deep waves. We got an Aries here. Somebody trying to do a love spell. White car. He big mad. Yeah, because somebody got to let you go or they don't want to let you go. Y'all soul contract. If somebody single, you single single. Yeah, somebody buy games so tired. Somebody was trying to play mind games over y'all or something like that. Or play a mind game like they wasn't interested. Child, they was lying for real. Okay, yeah, love always wins. This person really in love with you. Like, they been in love with you. They might tell you that in the next 48 hours here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, y'all. I don't I wanna be with you so bad. I don't love her. I want to be with you. Okay. Yeah. This person single. They gonna might be single. They might be single. They're going to be single in the next 48 hours. Okay. New moon. Somebody did something for money here. Uh-huh. Whoever this spiritual hate man is. So, like I said, this could be somebody that was trying to make people, make somebody think somebody was gay for pay. But it was like, what? Yeah. The hell? So, we got Tuesday, sister. They about to ghost you. Can you unblock me? I really want to talk to you Thursday. I'm watching you in tears. I said to serious Z. So somebody's sister could have blocked you. Yeah. They know they messed up bad here. Because this fire sign is in love with you. Okay. Because you got that wop, drip, drip energy. Okay. And it was a suicide mission. This person been caught for lying. Somebody could even try to pretend to be you on social media and catfish somebody. Somebody was saying somebody was not single when they was. Child, you are the one. All right. You connected to the all. All that is and all that will ever be here. Okay. We got S. All right. Realigning their thoughts to a higher perspective. Yeah, unfinished business with an air sign. Zaddy home, let them know. Okay, so somebody like Zaddy home, let them know what this air sign, fire sign is. There's somebody that was finding a connection, but love it when you, when you talk to them or whatever this is. Yeah. yeah, somebody with has a mental issues. Okay. Had a mental, she has mental issues. Okay. Uh huh. We got a Gemini, Destiny blue card. So y'all, it's a faded event happening here. All right, with somebody here. Yeah, I miss shit cooking. You are never alone. We got a Gemini Saturday. Okay, so we got the Gemini. I think it's the Gemini full moon, isn't it? Something like that. I think that's what it's called. I think it's a Gemini full moon. Maybe that's why Gemini coming out like this here. Yeah, I asked my friends to watch you for me, and they fell in love with you. And they was mad about that. 
All right, somebody feel bad for what they did here. I told you this is somebody that's cocky because they got a lot of, you know, a lot of cocky, okay? Um, and this weekend here, we got M. Firstly, it's middle initial. Yours it is. Opening your heart to new love, okay? Somebody feel like that's what you're doing. Okay, uh, you mean everything to me. I, did I say this at 333 energy? I felt it, okay? And then you got, you're on your right path to light here. So y'all on the right path right now, moving forward. True love. So you're on your path to true love. All right. I knew you were the one. Yeah, but the karmic was in the way. Whoever the fucking karmic is. Now they feeling bad because somebody could be cussing them the fuck out. Yeah, your emperor. Mm-hmm. Somebody scared of you in real life. Expect <laughs> positive changes. I told you somebody scared of your ass. I don't know. Because you so fucking magical and shit. Okay, but they still like to knock the fairy dust out your ass. But at the same time, it's like a little creepy. It's like a... I don't know. Somebody may have even told this person. Yeah, this karmic woman could have told you. Or that's the karmic woman that could be scared of your ass. But somebody could have told them that you was doing dark magic. Yeah, but it was her dumb ass. <laughs> Confirmation. Thank you, spirit. Whatever that was, it was her. She was trying to do dark magic on y'all or some shit. But God said, no thank you, sweetheart. Only good vibes, good energy up in here. Okay? Now they all in their head and their feelings. M-N-O or P. We got P. Alright. Um, yeah. Being a leader, taking inspired action here. It sounds too much. I'm about to text you. Alright, Taurus. Might get physical, physical, or verbally abusive. Yeah, leaving them behind is the best thing. God is in God's hands. All right. So they could be leaving a tourist behind. But you learned this lesson. You letting this shit go. Yeah, somebody learning a hard lesson. Because they, they, you let them go. All right. Yeah, it could be a Scorpio just fell out on the ground. Scorpio, Aquarius. Somebody is not of the light. That's why your spirit guys are stepping in. Like, hell no. You are... <sighs> Child. It says you are protected from all evil. We got D. People I trusted lied to me about you. But here I come. All right. Hold on. All right. So, yeah. I hope this helped you guys. 